guys welcome back to my channel i had planned to start vlogging a lot earlier today but Chanteo and i are having such a lazy day it started fairly early today because he had therapy here speech therapy but ever since we went to get water burger we eat and we're both like <laughs> we've just been sitting here chilling watching tv honestly so i don't know if it'll be an eventful vlog i don't know if i'll need to do like multiple like days because there's not much going on but i will bring you guys along <laughs> So Santiago absolutely destroyed my room today. I was just putting tinted moisturizer because we had the therapy session today. And just in that short time, he got all my good teeth out and my nail polishes that I could see. I think that's all he got to today. I like my lipsticks a certain way. He messed with it already, so I kind of have to reorganize everything. Honestly, this is a perfect time for me to throw some stuff out. This needs to go. This is such a bad timing. Like, I have to get ready soon. And here I am, playing with my lipsticks. I need to reorganize these real quick. I have problem with the same brands together so that I can get them easily. But I'm going to try to put my, like, neutrals on this one, the ones that I use the most. There we go. So I tried to brush my hair beforehand just because most of the time I forget to spray it when I'm doing section for section. I still try to do it when I remember. So you guys will see really quickly that I start forgetting, which is why I did this first. I'm almost out. This is not my favorite heat protector. My favorite is the one by Dry Bar. I just have like held back on like buying like the better products for my hair because of the... Here we go. I'm going to go into something that... I I feel like right now it's not the time to do it, but I'm going to do it anyways. Santiago's like private therapies were just like more expensive than I thought they were going to be. So me just like trying not to like let my husband feel like the financial hit. I just started like using like drugstore stuff. Right now we officially canceled those. I feel bad because I'm going back and forth between talking to you guys like this and like that. So sorry about that. I can't help it. I know that in the last video, I actually did talk about the therapies and how I felt like it wasn't a bad thing to like give Santiago help. He does still have the therapy sessions where they come here into our home. He's just not doing the private one, which is like where we're going to the place. And I think in the last vlog, I went to one because um, I believe I was getting ready for one. But anyways, because I don't feel like he's like super, super behind. And I feel like he is learning more from me because of the the therapies we have here in home. I, I don't remember if I talked about it. Basically... Those therapists teach me how to help Santiago. They're not working like directly with him. They work more with me. And everything that he has learned in the last couple of months has been stuff I've taught him, not stuff he got out of the therapist we were going to. So in this like time in our life, like it just makes sense for me to cancel those because they were getting out of hand expensive. You guys would not believe. That's a huge thing I wish we could talk about more. And like you guys would not believe how expensive they were. Yeah, we're dropping those. I'm working directly with Santiago and still continuing these therapies and the, the tools and resources they're giving me, which has been awesome. So that's where we're at right now. I even started using, like, I think it's called Maui shampoo or something like that from, like, Target. And, like, I started getting dandruff. <laughs> My hair feels really clean still and stuff like that, but I was like, uh-uh. Um, I also started using, like, an oil to help with the dandruff, so I controlled it, like, literally within a couple of days, thankfully. So I highly recommend, if you can, like if you have the money to like buy better stuff for your hair, do it. It's worth it. Your hair will thank you for it. Also, today, 
Santiago is starting gymnastics. We kind of like, it goes back to what I was saying about the therapies. Like I was like, what do I like about this therapy? The private therapy that I'm like sad to be letting go of. And it was the child interaction that Santiago was getting through these therapies. So um, we looked into gymnastics as our friends have their baby in it. And literally one month of gymnastics is how much a week of therapy costs with the private. So it just made a lot of sense to us because it's two sessions. I'm really, really excited to see him like be able to interact with other kids. They're also like supposed to teach him like to like listen to rules and orders. I don't want to say orders, like directions. There you go. I'm really excited. Today's his first session. I also have a viewing today. So it's kind of like about to get really chaotic this afternoon. I'm really sad. I'm not going to go in with Santiago to this gymnastics session because I have the viewing. When we went for the tour, I noticed like the parents were literally like sweating out of there. Like the ones that go in there. So Hector is going to do the first class with him. We'll watch out there without sweating as much as they do. Because I know like the parents even have to be like in um, workout clothes. <laughs> and then I'm going to head out to the viewing. And Santiago and Hector will come home just because the viewing is not a place for a toddler. Especially like he can't see still obviously. Also this week I have another session with my hairdresser but we're not gonna lighten my hair he's just gonna tone it which right now my hair is pretty yellow because if you guys remember i had red hair not that long ago so it's actually pretty impressive that my hair is this light and not literally orange um i can tell that people see my hair and they're like girl that is not a pretty color like i could tell like when they see me like after they've seen me like with a darker color they see me now but i'm like patience is key i'm not trying to go like super blonde in one session and then my hair be falling out like i'm very like we're gonna take it extremely slow i'm talking like a year long slow and i'm pretty good about being patient and i think that's why like he works with me and not i think he would have fired me by now because i change my hair way too often for him and like going red to blonde is like his biggest nightmare <laughs> so i'm so happy he hasn't fired me as his client but i really think that it has a lot to do with it like he knows that i'm willing to wait because he doesn't want nobody walking around with breaking hair and then like that's his reputation so yeah this next time is we're not lightning we're literally just toning and then the session after this we're lightning again and so on it's just we alternate so uh, my hair doesn't feel like it's about a big hit it took a big hit i'm curling my hair right now it's literally because of the viewing i try not to put heat on my hair unless i need to That's why my hair looked a hot mess in the beginning of this video. I'm kind of beating myself up because I had told myself I was going to do the heatless curls last night and I forgot. I just like have a really hard time pinpointing when the perfect time to put those in are and to take them out because I feel like if I go to sleep with them, it's not going to work. Um, I'm like too much of a crazy sleeper. Well, I'm not the crazy sleeper. My son is because he ends up in our bed like by 4 a.m. <laughs> so that's not going to work out. I just can't figure it out. If you guys have tips, please leave them in the comments below because that would literally change my life if I can figure out how to use those heatless curls. I'm gonna pick up a little bit before doing my makeup because I am running a tiny bit early. Um, I know this looks crazy but my son has like this little tent and he wanted me to go in there with him and the therapist was like why don't you just turn that into that space and he loves it um it reminded me when we were all little kids where is princess Shh. anyways it reminds me when we were all kids and we like to do like forts so it made a lot of sense to me he loves being in there he was like really calmly playing with his toys so i'm leaving that there i know it doesn't look good but it's working right now so match with this i feel like i should be wearing gold but it's gonna match for my viewing outfit um, i packed like a shirt to be able to put over like a tank top like this 
because it's gonna be way too hot to wear that to gymnastics. Sorry, I'm running super late. I didn't even see it. Like, I couldn't film getting ready with my makeup because I had to go, go, go. I don't know what I was thinking. And I messed up my makeup completely over and over and over and over. So this is where we're at. My makeup is a complete mess, but it's okay. We gotta go. Baby is still asleep. Okay, wait, sorry. The perfume for today is called Vanilla Potion. It's from Marshall. It's like a knockoff. It actually smells really good though. I couldn't let go of it when I smelled it at the store. I'm gonna take my Flower Bomb little perfume with me. But first, I'm gonna ask you guys, comment down below your favorite perfume. Like, whatever the season is, even if it's body spray, comment it down below. And three days after I post it, I will message the winner for a $10 Starbucks gift card. Not much, but just a little secret giveaway. But yeah, I packed the shirt and I packed my boots. I'm actually gonna take that out to the car before I wake up the baby, so I don't have to carry that out with me. Just got back. Time to change into comfy clothes. Who's in here? Who's in here? Oh my God, mommy too? <laughs> What are you guys doing? Huh? See, close, close. You want me to close it? Aww. Who's in here? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna remove my makeup. Not because I want to do it now. I want to remove it with you guys, like with like real face oil and stuff. But I need to put baby to sleep, and I don't like having makeup on my face. Just because I feel like he gets granitos if he touches it. And I just feel dirty, like, putting my makeup all over his clothes. Because for, like, sleep, he's going to fight me. I'm sure you guys saw it earlier in the video. He fights me lately. I don't know what's going on. So I don't want to put my makeup all over him. So I'm putting some makeup remover wipes to take it off. And then I'll come wash my face correctly, like, once it's time to go to sleep. And I'm sad I have to take it off because you guys know I don't like being too close to the camera when I look like that but with my acne scars mostly, but yeah. I also have you guys in this angle because my sink area is kind of a mess and I don't want to show it to you guys because I'm embarrassed. <laughs> I just realized I haven't um, explained to myself. I know I don't have any pictures up. We just took down our Christmas decorations and I haven't gone around to this. And like the pictures that are up were somewhere else in the house and they were just purely Christmas pictures. So that's why you guys see like that, but it will get fixed eventually. <laughs> Tomorrow. <laughs> Okay guys, so I'm gonna do that viral TikTok sleepy mocktail thing. I'm not gonna be adding magnesium powder because I already take magnesium pills, capsules at nighttime. Just <laughs> This is so good. Just kidding. <laughs> Open a poppy. We're doing cherry limeade. I honestly already wish I did less of the juice because when I see it, it's more fizzy than this. It's a bottle of lime juice. I've been seeing them do lemon, but we like lime, so. Juice. Hector didn't want a cute cup. Mm -hmm. No, okay. Don't be shy. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Good. The fuck is that? Hmm. The fuck is that? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know where did that come from. <laughs> but no, um, yeah. Overall, guys, I give it nine out of ten. Damn, really? I really liked it. It's alright, but I did. And then I just realized we did cherry with cherry and lime with lime. I give it a 7 out of 10. 7? Yeah, I mean, I give it alright. 
I'm not like, oh yeah. Mm. I can drink this every night. Yeah. For better sleep. Mm. I get it. I get it why the girlies are doing it. It's a cute mocktail too. It's a little because you're right back to sleep. That so you can't do it while you're watching a movie. Mm. Mm -hmm. But thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Hector approved. Alrighty guys, we're in bed. I totally forgot to film the rest of the night, but I realized it was really late because I started editing this vlog. Yeah, I was in the zone and I didn't see the time. It's really late now. So I gotta go because we need to look at our baby to put him in the crib, but... Say but... goodbye, everybody. Goodbye, everybody. <laughs> yeah? No. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe it would really help me out and i would really really appreciate it i'll see you guys in the next video bye